crafters and paper artisans, it's Shonda with Stock and Stuff. I am here with a project share. Uh, I'm actually giving it as a birthday present. And um, it is this little calendar easel. And um, I, I buy these um, 2023 calendars and then I just pull this off and end up using this for my grocery list. And so I bought about three or four. I was going to make the desk caddy for some people and I just didn't get to it because that one is a little time intensive. Easy, but time intensive nonetheless. And so I now I have like four packs of these calendars and I thought, well, what can I do that's quick and easy? And this, my dears, was really quick and easy. So it is like an easel and then you make a second piece that's a pocket and you glue it together and literally I just searched on Pinterest calendar easel D DIY calendar easels or something like that and it holds a sticky note and so a friend of mine has a birthday coming up um, by the time you see this video her birthday was yesterday and hopefully she will have gotten it in time and um, so I, I always whenever I'm at her house she's like using her dining room table light her desk and so I figured this would be um, something she could have there and so I made it brown because I figured you know for her dining room and then I decided to use my Prima diamond paper and you know I don't cut into this for everyone but I didn't cut any new 12 by 12 sheets I had some scraps that I had stuck in here um, and actually I used a cut apart page and so this is all from cut aparts um, and so this this is so that goes down you know about three quarters of the way and so that was just a flower that was a cut apart rounded corners and um, sticky note and then I backed the calendar on um, um, it was the bronze recollections foil and then I um, this is the back of another cut apart and then I did the honeybee jewels in the corners and then this was another cut apart that had a pretty good fit I trimmed it a little bit because I don't like I know a lot of people just cover the front but I like to cover the back and so I thought that was a pretty one to use um, and it had the bronze trim and then I used some up uh, some extra bronze trim on the side so that it would just have a finished look and it really was quick and easy and um, it folds flat and I'm gonna stick it in a clear bag with happy birthday at the top and put it in a little padded envelope and send her away so I'm hoping that she gets it on time I'm gonna mail it um, I'm going to mail it in the morning which might be her birthday I might be a little late but either way she'll get it and she'll be happy with it so uh, thanks for watching